What is going on guys and welcome to another video with your host as always K-Mac time now Walt Disney Studios was founded in the summer of 1923 making it over 90 years old to celebrate the decades of Disney greatness here are 91 facts about Walt Disney his theme parks and his movies. Walt Disney's original moniker was De Isne, showing his French roots. While this did not catch on, he eventually switched back to just Disney. Wally, -E, everyone's favorite rubbish compactor, was actually named after Walt Disney, Walter Elias Disney. The voice from Lilo from Lilo and Stitch is Devoy Chase, the same girl who voices Sarah Morgan in The Ring. Both Ariel and Belle are based off of real life model Sherry Stoner who is also a writer and producer for animations including The Animaniacs and Casper. Lots of early Disney films such as The Jungle Book, Pinocchio, and of course Bambi have characters that are motherless. This is thought to be a sign of guilt over the tragic death of Walt Disney's own mother in an accident that he blamed himself for. Disney animators are notorious for dropping Easter eggs and dropping characters in other shows. This can be seen in The Little Mermaid in the very beginning. You can see Goofy, Mickey, and Donald in attendance of King Triton's concert. The sorcerer in Fantasia is named Yen Sid, which is actually Disney spelled backwards. For a couple of years, Disney held the patent for Technicolor, making him the only animator allowed to make films in color. Disneyland in California was built in the early 1950s, opening in 1955. Anxious to be on site as much as possible, Walt Disney built an apartment for his family above the fire department on Main Street. A lamp signaled to workers that he was in his residence. This lamp is now always lit in his honor. Disney World opened in Florida in 1971. However, Walt Disney was unsettled by the sight of costume characters having to run through the wrong world or wrong land to get to their allotted spots. To overcome this, he came up with an elaborate tunnel system which runs beneath Disney World and allows actors to put on their costumes and appear in the appropriate land without shattering the illusion. The entire park is built on a gentle incline to accommodate these. The rules for those playing theme park characters include never using the word no, never breaking character or sitting down, and never pointing out a direction with a single finger. All Disney theme parks use a special patented smellalizer device that designed to pump certain scents around. You can get scents from sea salt, representing the Pirates of the Caribbean, and vanilla on Main Street. When it was first opened, Disney World guests weren't granted admission if they had any facial hair, which is kind of funny considering that Walt Disney rocked a mustache from the age of 25 on. Main Street is based on 1910 America, while Tomorrowland is based off 1986. They were both chosen because these are both Haley's Comets years. Sleeping Beauty's castle's design is used as forced perspective, so while the castle may seem to rise up into the clouds, thanks to painted bricks that get smaller towards the top, it's actually only 189 feet tall. There is an exclusive Disney club called Club 33. This opened in 1967 and is hidden above the Blue Bayou in New Orleans Square. It has a strict members list that only includes 487 members and a waiting list of around 14 years. Dumbo the Elephant is the only main character in all Disney movies to never speak a line in any of his time on screen. Speaking of silent protagonist, The Sleeping Beauty featured Aurora, who only gets an 18 lines of dialogue in just 18 minutes of on-screen time in her own film. Solely from Monsters, Inc. has more than 2.3 million individual hairs which are carefully animated. This explains why it takes over 12 hours to produce one frame with this character. Clarence Nash, also known as Donald Duck's voice, also created the dog barks for 101 Dalmatians. Also, tiger roars were used instead of lions in The Lion Kings, as lions were deemed not loud enough. While we know him as Prince Charming, the man who steals Cinderella's heart and supper is actually never given a real name throughout the movie. Simba is Swahili for lion, while Baloo is Hindu for bear. Bruce, the vegetarian great white shark of Finding Nemo, was actually named after the mechanical shark used in the film Jaws, which in turn was named after Steven Spielberg's lawyer. Wayne Anthony Allwine, who was the voice of Mickey Mouse for 32 years, eventually got married to Rusie Taylor, who played Minnie in 1991. The two remained happily married until his death in 2009. If you send Mickey and Minnie Mouse an invitation to your wedding, they'll send you back an autographed photo and a Just Married's badge. It is actually rumored that Walt Disney suffered from an extreme phobia of mice. Walt Disney's original creation was originally going to be named Mortimer until his wife persuaded him that the name Mickey had a better ring to it. 
Each year, several dozen families ask to scatter their loved one's ashes into the Haunted Mansion ride at Disneyland. The answer is always no, but sometimes families have been caught in the act. Disney World was evacuated on September 11, 2001, just 30 minutes after the attacks. They then worked through the night to erect the 4th of July decorations so it could reopen the following day with a national sense of patriotism. Adults have misplaced an estimated 1.65 million pairs of glasses at Disney World since 1971. Every year, the park finds an average of 6,000 cell phones, 3,500 digital cameras, and over 18,000 hats. Walt Disney was presented with one normal-sized honorary Oscar and seven little Oscars for his part in Snow White and the Seven Dwarves in 1938. In Monsters, Inc., Boo's real name is Mary after her voice actress, Mary Gibbs. You can see it written on the drawing in her room. The Disney World Resort is about the same size as the entire city of San Francisco. It would take an estimated 68 years to sleep in every single room at Disney World. Man is in the Forest was a code used by animators to warn colleagues to get back to work when Walt Disney was coming down the hall. Disney over the years has been known to downplay the deaths of participants on site, but in 2007, a death of a teenager who lost consciousness on a roller coaster in Disney Paris made worldwide headlines. Walt Disney's final words for his death were written rather than spoken. They were Kurt Russell. No one, including the actor himself, has any idea why. Disney flew its flags at half-mast on the day that Apple co-founder Steve Jobs died. Jobs was Disney's largest single shareholder at 7% of the company and was on the board of directors. Cars also featured a white racing car with an Apple logo on it and the number 84, which refers to the year Apple computers was first released. The character Mickey Mouse was the first animated character to get his very own star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. The two-minute storm scene from The Little Mermaid took 10 special effects artists over an entire year to finish. Walt Disney once played Peter Pan in a school play as a child. Mickey Mouse was also the first animated character to talk. His first words in 1929 cartoon The Carnival Kid were hot dog. The film Lilo and Stitch features more Elvis Presley songs than any of the movies the actual singer himself ever appeared in. Glenn Keane, who was the actual animator from Beauty and the Beast, took inspiration from the zoo to come up with the Beast character, blending the mane of a lion, the horns and head of a buffalo, the eyebrows of a gorilla, the tusks of a wild boar, the upper body of a bear, and the legs and tail of a wolf to create the rather likable character. The Hunchback of Notre Dame actually features cameos from Belle, Aladdin's Magic Carpet, and even Pumbaa, who is trussed up and ready for cooking. Disneyland is actually the full of stray cats. While the park doesn't encourage them, it does not kill them or kick them out either, as they provide a nifty pest control service. Walt Disney's personal favorite Disney character of all time was the tie-wearing dog, Goofy. Contrary to all rumors and popular belief, Disney's daughter has assured the press that he was not actually cryogenically frozen after he died. Walt Disney also placed garbage bins in all Disneyland parks 25 steps away from hot dog and other concession stands, as this is how long and how many steps it took him to eat a hot dog. To capture the movement of Aladdin's low-cut baggy pants, animator Glenn Keane watched MC Hammer videos to get a model correct. Walt also built a major railroad in his backyard called the Carrollwood Pacific Railroad. It had 2,615 feet of track, including trussels, loops, overpasses, and even a tunnel. People have often claimed to spot hidden messages within Disney's films. One of the better known ones is when Simba flops down to the ground and creates a cloud of dust that appears to spell the word sex. However, the story goes, this actually reads SFX and it was put there by the special effects team as a signature. However, there was a little bit racier hidden message in The Rescuers where a photo of a nude lady was leaked into the background. Disney actually admitted to this and had to recall 3.4 million VHS. The voice of Mike Wazowski from Monsters, Inc. is done by Billy Crystal. He was also offered the job to do Buzz Lightyear's voice in Toy Story, but declined. He often requires this to be his biggest regret. Disney princesses have to fit a certain body type to work in the theme parks. While princesses are usually between 5'4 and 5'7, Tinkerball and Alice are more petite at 4'11 to 5'2. Also, you cannot be any older than 28 years old to be a Disney princess in the parks. The final film Walt Disney personally oversaw was The Jungle Book, just before its death from lung cancer in 1966. It is in the official Disneyland rules that all pogo sticks are forbidden from the premises. As of 2014, there have officially been three babies born at Disneyland. Sadly, none of them were named Mickey or Minnie.
At age 16, Walt Disney actually signed up for the army, but was rejected because he was too young. Instead, he became an ambulance driver for World War I in France. On a trip to Disneyland Paris, George Lucas decided to film the Star Wars attraction during a ride, something as against park rules. An oblivious staff member actually tried to have him removed from the ride before he was set straight. With about 78 million sold, Mickey Mouse ears are one of the most popular souvenirs from all Disney parks. Names can be embroidered on the back, but you cannot get the name of a famous person, sports team, corporation, or personal business embroidered on them. Several doggy characters from the Lady and the Tramp movie appear in the pet shop window of 101 Dalmatians. Also, in that movie, there are reported 6,469,952 black spots. The Ken doll in Toy Story 3 is based on the Animal Lovin' Ken from 1988. In 1957, President Harry Truman took a trip to Disneyland and but refused to ride the Dumbo ride because elephants are a symbol for the Republican Party. The Matterhorn roller coaster at Disneyland has a secret basketball court inside it for Disneyland staff to use. The ideas for Wall-E, Monsters, Inc., A Bug's Life, and Find Nemo were came from a single lunchtime brainstorming session in 1994 between the team that was working on Toy Story. Disneyland employees only have their first names featured on their workplace badges. This is because Walt hated being called Mr. Disney. In 2004, Disney actually auctioned off a chance to name a gravestone at the Haunted Mansion ride in Disneyland. The winner, Carly Sharp, paid $37,400 on eBay to become the attraction's 1,000th ghost. Though commonly referred to as Snow White and the Seven Dwarves, the film actually has the title of Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs. This would be because in 1938, when the film was released, dwarfs was an acceptable plural form of the word. Mickey Mouse only has four fingers on each hand because the animators thought he looked too strange with five. It has become a well-known fact that Disney theme parks do not allow their staff members to date one another. When the Pirates of the Caribbean ride opened in 1967, the only fake skeletons available to Disneyland designers were rather crappy. So instead, they used real skeletons, which were previously used for medical research at UCLA's medical center. The bully boy Sid from Toy Story has a hallway carpet which is very similar to the design as the Nightmares Corridors in The Shining. This is due to the Toy Story editor Lee Oonkrick who adores the actual film. To achieve a natural skin tone for Snow White, they used real rouge and applied it to animated cells. Disney World is second only to the U.S. military when it comes to purchasing explosives within the United States. This is for their nightly fireworks show that display millions and millions of fireworks per year. Aurora is the only true blonde in the princesses, as Cinderella is somewhat strawberry and Rapunzel is a natural brunette turned into blonde by magic. Sections of certain Disney films may give you a sense of deja vu. The company recycled much of its early animations in a technique called rotoscoping, which was invented in 1915 in order to cut production cost. Large parts of the 1973 film Robin Hood were taken directly from Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs, The Jungle Book, and The Aristocrats. While there is an urban legend that the fairy Tinkerbell was actually based on Marilyn Monroe, she is in fact based on the actress Margaret Carey. Thanks to its swampland setting in Florida, Disney World frequently attracts alligators, which have previously been found in swimming around in Splash Mountain and even found in public toilets. Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs was a make or break movie for Disney, costing our studios around $1.4 million to make. However, this has became one of the top 10 highest grossing films of all time. Lilo means gorgeous one in Hawaiian. The Little Mermaid has over 1 million hand-drawn bubbles shown throughout the entire movie. You can also see Ariel in a cameo in the Mermaid Lagoon during Peter Pan's flight. Space Mountain is one of the oldest operating roller coasters in the entire country. Pocahontas holds a world record for the largest movie premiere, with over 100,000 people attending the premiere. The four vultures from The Jungle Book were originally supposed to be voiced by the Beatles, however the band was just too busy to make the recording of it. Epcot, which is one of Disney's famous parks, stands for Experimental Prototype Community of Tomorrow. Chica from The Emperor's New Groove was the first pregnant woman to ever appear in a Disney animated feature film. And finally, The Lion King was originally going to be called King of the Jungle. 
This was before someone actually noted that lions do not actually inhabit the jungles. All right, thank you guys so much for sticking around to this whole video. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys smash that like button. We get to over 600 likes. I'll drop out the next video a day early for you guys. Make sure you guys, if you guys are new around here, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel, get more of these videos in your sub box. Also drop the code word. Let me know you guys made it all the way through this 15 minute long video. Go ahead and drop the word Mickey Mouse in the comments and I will know you guys made it to the end of the video. Thank you guys again for watching. Really do appreciate it. As always guys, have a great day. Remember that's Kamek time somewhere and I will speak to you again shortly. Until then, take it easy and peace out.